Gun Venture is brought to you by Smith & Wesson, Black Hills Ammunition, and Gundelio. All right, we're coming into the Denver area. We're going to go to the Centennial Gun Club. I can see the mountains coming up just ahead of us. A great day for a gun venture. Dick, it's an incredible place you have here. This typifies what we're now calling the Gun Tree Club idea. How did you arrive at the idea of going upscale? I have been to a number of ranges around the country. One that really stood out to me as being unique was Scottsdale Gun Club. Sure. And realized that we had nothing like that in the front range of Colorado and uh, decided that it was probably a, a good opportunity to do some market research, build a business plan, talk to a lot of people. We're in a high-end neighborhood in this area and decided to, to build a really nice club for our, our members. So tell me about the reaction on the part of the public, because they haven't seen anything like this here before. No, a lot of people are really surprised when they walk in the door. We can always tell a first-time visitor. They walk in the door and take about four steps and stop and look around, and we know it's their first time in. So When you first come in the entry, uh, we have our, our safes right by the front door, which make an attractive entrance. Come right into our retail area, and in the retail, we have about 5,000 square feet of retail. Well, the ranges are all 25 yards. Uh, we use uh, steel traps uh, in the range. Uh, we have wireless target systems that uh, have turning targets. We have about 100 guns. We have uh, handguns, we have uh, rifles, uh, we have suppressed guns, machine guns, shotguns. So about anything that somebody wants to try out. We're just opening our active shooter response training center. Uh, we have a 15-year Navy SEAL that uh, is, uh, is running that uh, training mm -hmm. for us. Now, I notice that there's a special area in the back. What's that? There is. That's our Statesman Lounge. And that's sort of a club within the club. And so it's a, a comfortable area for corporate executives and people that just love to shoot. We do a lot of corporate entertaining back there. Uh, people bring clients in. They bring uh, co-workers in. And uh, they've got their own private range. They've got eight, eight lanes there and a really comfortable lounge for them to, to relax and enjoy in. While we're at the Centennial Gun Club, it gives me a chance to do something you always need to do. I know you have your carry gun and you have your good defensive ammo in it, but then you go to the range and you shoot your practice ammo, which makes sense, but every once in a while you want to shoot your good defensive ammo in your carry gun just to make sure that everything is working the way it should. So I've loaded up some of this really good Black Hills hollow point ammo, it's good carry ammo, got the Springfield Armory XDS, run this target out to about seven yards and shoot it a little bit. Well, the gun's working. Let's find out if I'm doing my part. Tom needs a little work. Low and left, that means you're milking the trigger. You need to get back to work on this. That's why we practice this. It's great to come to a super place like this where you can shoot anything. They'll even let you practice your draw here, which a lot of ranges won't let you do. That means this is a modern facility. They understand why people are shooting these days. Coming up, we're at the baddest racetrack in the world, Talladega Super Speedway.